Canadian researchers launched a study Monday, March 23, into the use of a powerful anti-inflammatory drug to reduce the risks of pulmonary complications and death related to the coronavirus. If it proves to be successful, the drug is readily available and inexpensive and can become a key tool in the pandemic fight. Meantime, China announces Tuesday, March 24, an end to travel bans in Hubei province. The novel coronavirus epicenter will allow healthy residents to travel from midnight Tuesday, two months after they were ordered to stay indoors. Meanwhile, Italy reports a second successive drop in daily deaths and infections from COVID-19 Monday. The number of new decline infections fell from 6,557 on Saturday to 4,789 on Monday. Italy's infection toll is more than that of China and Spain combined. Spain is the third highest number of COVID-19 infections.